Hello everyone. Have you wondered why sky sometimes appears blue, sometimes white and sometimes red? Why does sky turn red during sunrise and sunset? Let us explore an interesting phenomena. Do you remember the Tyndall effect experiment with diluted milk? When light passes through diluted milk, its path becomes visible. The light gets scattered by colloid particles which enlighten the whole solution. But small particles in a solution don't scatter light. So Tyndall effect experiment was used to differentiate a colloid and a solution. But what do we really mean by scattering of light? When any atom or molecules are exposed to light, it absorbs light energy and starts vibrating more. Then it emits some part of that light energy in different directions. This is the basic event happening during the scattering of light. Now the effect of light on a particle depends on its size. For example, small particles will scatter light of lower wavelength and higher frequency. The particle absorbs the light then vibrates and emits certain fraction of absorbed light in all direction. That light is called scattered light. The particle that scatters light is the scattering center. Now our atmosphere has abundant of oxygen and nitrogen. The sizes of these molecules are small and these are more effective in scattering blue light of small wavelength. So these molecules absorb sunlight and act as scattering center for blue light. Hence the sky appears blue. <coughs> and what happens during sunset and sunrise? Well during sunset and sunrise the sky appears red because red light has longest wavelength. During this time the sunlight needs to travel the longest to reach earth. Other shorter wavelengths are mostly scattered away during the long travel of sunlight from sun to earth. Red light doesn't get scattered much because of its long wavelength of red light. There are very few particles in atmosphere which act as scattering center for red light. So the light we receive during this time that is during sunrise and sunset has the highest portion of red light which doesn't get absorbed and scattered away. Hence the sky appears red during this time. And what happens during noon time? During noon the sky appears whitish. As the light from the sun overhead would travel relatively shorter distance very little part of the light gets scattered and hence it appears white. Sir C. V. Raman first explained the phenomena of scattering of light in liquids and gases and received the Nobel Prize for his works. He found that the frequency of scattered light by the liquids is greater than the frequency of the incident light. This is called Raman effect. This phenomena is used to determine the size of molecules. So that was all about scattering of light. Bye bye.